could begin with the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag, written by a Democratic Socialist. Walt Whitman, Martin Luther King Jr. Albert Einstein, Socialist to the core. Socialism is as American as apple pie. Most socialists begin with a critique of inequality. Basic human rights need to be provided for. Teachers are buying supplies out of our own pockets. I decided to run for office. I saw what can happen when the systems that are designed to protect working people fail us. Society changes when people who otherwise don't have power stand up. Five individuals own more wealth than the entire bottom half of the human population. We there is an outrage on the part of the people, Mr. Chairman, that is not necessarily perceived here in Congress. We believe in democracy. The problem with the word socialism is that it's been equated with totalitarianism. The red scare, anybody who uses the big scary S word is automatically Stalin. It doesn't work anymore. We've got thousands of teachers who've come to this building demanding answers. When you can't do your job without having to have a second job to pay the bills, that's bull****. Democratic socialism is the value that in a modern, moral, and wealthy society, no person in America should be too poor to live. Our job is to change the world in the United States of America. It's possible to design a society and economy based on people's most pressing needs. More voice from the workers <laughs> actually benefits the company. Yes. <laughs> Socialism is really, at heart, the ultimate expression of democracy. If that's not American, I don't know what is. 